Alfa Romeo's newest SUV, with its sleek design, drew attention and intrigue. But controversy arose when an Italian minister questioned the name Milano due to production taking place in Poland instead of Italy. This seemed unusual, but Alfa Romeo skillfully transformed the situation into a marketing advantage. Uh, Alfa Romeo, the Italian car manufacturer, has revealed that the Milano model will now be known as the Alfa Romeo Junior. Uh, according to Alfa Romeo CEO Jean-Philippe Imperato, this second name change was made with the intention of fostering better communication between parties while he playfully acknowledged the Italian government for the unexpected promotion. Uh, previously, Adolfo Urso, uh, Italy's former Minister of Enterprises and Made in Italy, uh, raised concerns over car in Milano uh, being manufactured in Poland. Uh, he believed consumers might be misled into thinking the SUV originated from Milan, uh, the fashion capital which he found questionable. However, given that numerous international automakers produce vehicles outside their home countries, this assertion seems is not for us. Although certain that the Milano label was valid legally, Alfa Romeo chose to rebrand as a more effective response to the controversy. The executive stressed that the attention should have expectations to shift towards the car's design and performance rather than getting embroiled in political disputes. How about this instead? The new name brings us to the next topic. Alfa Romeo's junior model boasts a storied past. Debuting in 1966, the GT1300 Junior was called an alluring sports car for young buyers. It became an instant sensation, with sales exceeding 92,000 units during its production. A new compact SUV for an Alfa Romeo named Junior boasts an aggressive design and marks Alfa's entry into all electric vehicles, measuring 177.2 inches long. This model is set to come from the cruise rush to the white side fun right. A guy more starting in the bad and a bad light twin kicking. The Milano incident brought significant interest. Alfa Romeo's emerging SUV lineup. Alfa Romeo's website experienced unprecedented traffic due to the controversy, causing it to crash momentarily. The junior's first model will keep the brand relevant in a competitive market. However, the question remains. Can Alfa Romeo turn the buzz into actual sales? Although the new Junior is essentially a revamped Jeep Avenger or Lancia Ypsilon, this isn't inherently negative. Nevertheless, the $41,300 launch price tag might pose a challenge for substantial sales.